Jesus was a different sort of king. His realm was, his kingdom was a different sort of realm than the world had ever seen before. We shouldn't be too surprised that he was often misunderstood. We shouldn't be too surprised that others were a bit defensive as they encountered him. Jesus' vision was God's vision, revealed in a way that was fuller and grander than we had ever seen it before. And this day, Good Friday, is a key piece of that kingdom picture. Good Friday is not good because of the pain and the suffering and the death. There's really nothing good about those things. Good Friday is good because it reveals a different way of traveling through the most painful and difficult things we could ever experience in this life. Betrayal, torture, a horrible and, and painful death, all taken with grace. It's from that very cross that Jesus embraces the thief. It is from the unbelievable suffering that Jesus says, forgive them for they know not what they do. Astounding. Unique. But it is that attitude that not only fills our lives, but spills over touching the lives of others. The attitude of Christ in the midst of the worst that life can send his way, touching others, forgiving, enduring, refusing, refusing to get even, refusing to strike out. This is the attitude of Christ. Others are not horrible people because of what they do. It's an opportunity for them to discover the God who cares. It's an opportunity for us to share the God who makes our lives new. A different sort of king, a different sort of kingdom. And Jesus saw it struggling to take shape in everything that he did, in every place that he went, not only in himself, but in those like you who were drawn to him. This is Ben Moore from West Highlands United Methodist Church with a thought for your day. Just another way of reaching out. Thank you.